and so that feed regularly catches like three, four pounders on it. Wow. They must love it. Yeah, I think once the sun comes up, all these docks will have fish, but they're probably out roaming right now. Yeah. Nice. Not a bad one. Yep. Good start to the day, that's for sure. Come on, buddy. You've been here for what? 10 minutes? Yeah. Nope. Relax. About to release yourself, dude. Yeah. Dang. There you go, you guys. First one of the day. A little dink. See you later, dude. Oh. Boom, got one. Now weed. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I do that all the time. Yeah, follow it up. My drag was so loose, my drag slipped. Oh, it's a, it's a little one. My drag slipped. I totally forgot I loosened my drag. No, man, a fish up. Yep, fish is a fish. There you go, you guys. Nice little guy, pretty fish though. Good looking fish. You see that picture I shared on Instagram of that bass that had that horn on it or whatever? Oh, that that blister? That <laughs> yeah, man. I've never seen and it was it was like pus filled. It was definitely some kind of a blister or something. Yeah. Yeah, it is, man. Pop this motor up a little bit. Like I only got to take the girls on once on my boat because yeah. we always had other things planned. Yeah. And I was gonna take them fishing that freaking weekend. Because we had them on the fourth and I was gonna freaking take them out. The thing is they like just riding in the boat too, like just cruising around. Ooh. Good one? Yep. Well no, it's it's not huge, but it's a decent one. Yeah, that's the best one of the day. Oh, oh. Whoa, we jumped right in. That's a two plus. He choked. Oh, watch, watch, watch your nuts. Nice, dude. All right, he did. He choked it though. I set my rod down. Jesus, Jesus. Yeah. You want to do me a favor, real quick? In my backpack, in this front pocket, like the kind. No, the yeah, that one. There's some surgical pliers, some doctor pliers, because he choked it. So I want to... Oh yeah, hemostats. There we go. Give him a little oxygen there. Well, there we go, folks. Get that line out of his gills. Hang on to this guy. Give him some oxygen because we're going to have to do some surgery on him. Pop this hook out. Yeah, not too bad, huh? Yeah, that's like a two plus. Yeah, that's some size for today. A little long and skinny. Yep. Let's find this. Did he, get in his, did he get in the throat? Yeah, I'm gonna go through the gills yeah. and roll it out. Find out where the barbs at. There we go. Boom. Just like that. That's how you do it, folks. Boom. Nice little chunker. I don't think we need to weigh him. Elijah calls about two, and I, I agree with that. A little, little over Hi. two. Long yeah. and skinny. Right on. Let's get the release going. Bye bye. Nice. Right on. Right on, right on, right off that big lay down. Boom. Right on. Keep fishing up on these, on this pad edge. Yeah, they must be, just like you said, they must be lower down there, real low in the water column, because I just 
let it sink and set my rod down and then he smoked it. Give it a little bit longer soak time. Nice, I had to tighten my drag too. It's like, <laughs> I think that's a fish. Let me tighten that up. Yeah, it's weird, man. I feel like sometimes fish will either look bigger or smaller in the water. It just yeah. depends, because that one didn't look as big as it was. But then I remember when you caught that one on the jig at... Uh... Another one? Ooh, that good one? Yep. It's better. Open the left nut, huh? There we go. You want to take the front? No, no, we're good, man. Woo, there we go. Another nice little one, you guys. Nice little three quarter of a pounder. No, I thought it was a pounder. You think so? Yeah. I'm always undercutting the fish. Cause I, you know, I just don't want to be that guy. It's like, oh, that's a two. And then everybody's like, bro, that's not a two pounder or something. That, that's over 12 and 12 inches are almost always over a pound or right around a pound at least. There we go. Man, these guys are just sucking this sanko in. Killing it. Hungry. Oh, yeah. Well, there you go, you guys. Cabin Creek four pack. The oval sinking worm. Oh, come on, buddy. Digging? That, oh, a dink was a pound of salad. Nice. <laughs> That's why, look, he's, you know, I'm not even telling you. What's funny is this is the first time that I've actually pulled in more more grass. Than bass? Than bass, yeah. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Double up, you guys. There we go, folks. Boom. I, I've seriously never pulled in that much grass before. On a Sanko oh, fish? On a, yeah, on a tiny fish. Oh, we are just hooking the bottom lip. Oh wow. All right. Yeah. Oh, sure. Gross. You're just about cutting. I don't know if you do you save your Sankos? Uh, sometimes I, I, I re melt them. Yep, yep, me too. I got a bag of all the colors at the house. Man, this this log put it on for us yeah. for a couple of seconds, man. Holy crap. You could probably come back and grab a couple more off. Of yeah, hell yeah. Let's see. I wonder if it's because there's bass nearby and they're trying to eat it before the other ones do. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, maybe there's not too much forage out here. So you can go ahead and get under that if you can. Yeah, see, I can't do that yet, man. It's, it's not that bad. I mean, it's like pitching the jig. Like, you just have to hold it to keep tension. And then you I think just that might be a bass. Like anything, you just have to try it a few times. Oh, yeah, that's a fish. It's swimming towards us. Oh, that was like a good one. I don't think it's a giant, but it's... Oh, yeah, that's a big one. <laughs> that's a two and a half easy. Not bad, not bad. Thank you, bro. Oh good. yeah, he's that choking it. Yeah, he's bleeding. Oh yeah. Oh my God, that fish is. Oh, he's bleeding. Gushing. I don't get it. These fish today—they're just—they're—they're they're eating it so quick. Stay alive, buddy. I don't. I do not want to take you home. All right. All right. Where them? They're choking the bait so quick. It's insane. I gotta get this worm out of here. So I, ow, your crusher is, ow, god damn it. Man, that crush plate they got back there that sucks it in. Oh, yeah. Woo, that really sucks it in, man. All right, let's keep you in the water. Let me get my Senko out so I can see where the hook's at. Oh, God, you super choked it, bro. All right, let's run some water, forward water through your nails. Let's get out from underneath these pads here. That's all right. All right. I saw you cut the smoke in your rod there, but I was like, that's a good one. <laughs> yeah, they're smoking it, man. Wow, he didn't, like, he wasn't even really that bad. It just must have got him in a really yeah, sweet it spot. Yeah, nipping in the gill real quick. Well, there you go, you guys. Good fish. What do you think, two? Uh, Maybe? I'd say High one? Closer to two and a half. Closer to two and a half. There we go, folks. Another nice one. Because, I mean, he's... he's it's got some deep, eh, oh yeah. yeah, you can see where the hook got him. It just got him yeah, in a just, sweet spot. Yeah, just, just nicked him in the gill. Yeah, that's that's like a, I'd say like two and a quarter. So that's definitely a two. Point. Nice. 
Right on. Here we go, you guys. Here she goes. Hungry, there I she goes. Or, or if I have like a batch of stinkos, it just fucking won't sink. Yeah, I get those every once in a while. Like I got these. I don't know if you've seen them. They're the yeah, this fucking thing, the smart baits worms. It it sucks. It might as well be floating. Yep, sucks ass, bro. Ooh. Oh man, it, that thing took off with it. Yeah. Dude, they're 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 competing for food. So what they're doing is they're they're smashing it and trying to run away. I'm surprised we haven't had other bass like come up and try to steal it. Man, yeah, that only happens to me at like uh, only time I've had that happen was at Ohop, but I caught one and then I had like a big seven pounder tailing. Oh. There you go, you guys. Another. Yep, I seen that. Kind of hang out here for a minute if you want to hit them again. Got one. Nice. Not bad. Yeah, it's one of your things hooked on. Get out of here so I don't blow my rod tip out. Now, let's get this fish on. Get this guy on his way. Oh, you got like double hooked, oh, my man. No, I'm looking at it. You see it? You saw the boat and you swam off. Not bad, bro. There we go, buddy. And you got my last. Freaking worm too, dude. Well, you guys, there's a another one right there. Yeah, I think he took the cabin creek.